Rent Nichols, Huntsville Doppler, and this, this is our town, and this, this is the Bayview Hotel. I mean, anyone who grew up in Huntsville or visited Huntsville or spent time in Huntsville probably has a story about the Bayview Hotel. I remember my dad telling me that at one time there were separate entrances for men and for women. It was always the place when I was growing up where there was live music and probably the first place that I had a drink in this town. Well, legally, that is. Quite a history in this building. I mean, when you would arrive by train, this is the building that would meet you. This would be your welcome to Huntsville. You'd walk up the hill and hopefully get yourself a nice cold draft and maybe a room just to settle in for the night. It was the place where they used to have the treat of the week as well. That's right, female dancers. Or I should say, dancer. It was usually one woman that came up from Toronto and she'd stay here for the weekend. Everybody would know her name by the time she left and knew exactly when she'd be coming back. Ah, the stories you hear. This was also the place that had the best live music when I was, I don't know, 19, 20, 21. Living in Toronto at the time, but would always visit the Bayview on my return home. And the view from that back deck. I'm not sure what's happening with this building, but somebody seems to be working away at it, trying to improve it, brick by brick by brick. There's something to be said about brick by brick. It'll be interesting to see what this building turns out to be, but I definitely have some fond memories of the Bayview. I mean, it was in this building that I really understood when someone said, don't worry, I have your back kind of what they meant. And to this day, I owe a huge thank you to both John Brooks and Dallas Clark for that. Rand Nichols, Huntsville Doppler, and this, this is our town.